Shakira fans are freaking out today because apparently Tom Cruise is extremely interested in pursuing her. Welcome to Popcorn Planet. I'm Mandy Signor. Yes, we talked about this a little bit yesterday, but the story has grown and we've dug a little bit deeper into the friendship. Yes, this is apparently a long formed friendship between Tom Cruise and music superstar Shakira Shakira. Uh, so here we go. We got to break down the latest. So fans today are uh, freaking out because, yes, the story has not died down. It's only gotten bigger. Also, I that doesn't look like Tom Cruise to me. It's, I'm like, is that Tom? Yeah, I guess just age. And I usually see him in the serious profile, not used to seeing him from above with the look. I, is it just me? I was like, wow, that's him. Uh, but that's definitely Shakira. And yeah, who was who? Who wouldn't be interested in Shakira? Let's keep it a buck. Uh, yeah, Tom Cruise apparently wants to court Shakira in what could be a new romance. But her fans are having hilarious reaction to the news. Stay the H-E double hockey sticks away. Page Six came out with a story on Tuesday. Here it is. Uh, the race is on for single Shakira. Now, I remember when she went single, it was like, wasn't like Chris Evans. Like, everybody was getting in on the liking and following Shakira out of nowhere. Uh, because, of course, Shakira is a massively successful, intelligent, and beautiful, uh, now available woman. And, uh, yeah, the Hips Don't Lie singer was photographed hanging out together in the Formula One Grand Prix in Miami over the weekend here in Florida. Source exclusively told Page Six he is extremely interested in pursuing her. There is chemistry, says the source. Cruz 60 is single, and Shakira, 46, just split from her longtime boyfriend, Gerard Peak, um, last June. Allegations were that he was having an affair with now girlfriend, Clara, whatever. Shakira needs a soft pillow to fall on, and that could be Tom. Adding that Cruz has the benefit of being a nice-looking guy, and he's talented. Well, he's got a lot of baggage with him, too, that whole, uh, you know, Scientology thing. Let's let's not ignore that. Source also cracks, and she isn't taller than him. So there you go. She's, I guess, shorter than Tom. That's a deal. Katie was taller, I think. Cruz is 5'7", while pop star is tiny, 5'2". Uh, source tells us that Cruz was taken by the pop diva that he allegedly sent her flowers yeah that's where we're hearing it she sent he sent her flowers uh that's how much she was into her that's how much uh they were spotted together uh on sunday uh during the race's starting grid and we're seen chatting in a private hospitality suite shakira and peak were together for 12 years and shared two children sasha and milan it's been tough not only for me but also my kids incredibly difficult she told L back in September. I can only say that I put everything I had into this relationship and my family, and she now lives in Miami. But there's Tom uh, showing up, and uh, he has three kids of his own, Isabel and Connor, married Nicole Kidman, and Surrey, 17, who he shares with Katie Holmes. We've talked about that. Uh, he reportedly most recently dated uh, Kay Haley Outwell, his Mission Impossible 7 co-star. I didn't realize, I guess they dated, and now they aren't dating. They split in September of 2021 again for the final time and again for the final time in 2022. I guess during filming they were together and then when they weren't filming, they broke up. I guess she won't be in more sequels. <laughs> we'll see. Uh, but yeah, we have the footage here. Uh, this was them like in the luxury box at the Miami Grand Prix. Like Tom Cruise is yucking it up while her kids are there. Look at that. That's not like just a normal, like, you know, hey, what's up? He's there hanging with her and her kids. They're at the Grand Prix, and he's not watching the game. He's watching Shakira, Shakira. <laughs> I mean, no joke. And it wasn't like this was just some small little thing. No, they then walked out together. There were numerous photos and uh, images putting these together. Shakira, listen to me. He's trying to recruit you into Scientology. Don't go out with him. Listen to me, Shakira. <laughs> Tom Cruise is reportedly very interested. Here it is. Uh, don't do it. Don't do it. Because uh, obviously this is Nicole after she left because of the whole Scientology stuff. Uh, but yeah, the past relationships, connections to Scientology, they feel like that's not going to do well for her or anybody, I suppose. Um, and uh, man, Shakira, definitely, definitely in demand with all the fellas out there. And I'm sure some of the ladies do. So uh, yeah, he's, he's taking a shot. Shakira fans aren't having it. What do you guys think? Here they are together. Uh, should they uh, go together? Well, apparently, 
apparently, as they, sorry, I was trying to get more of these images that they're, here they are, some more images. She was also out rubbing shoulders with Playboy driver Lewis Hamilton uh, after bonding romantically with romantically interested Tom Cruise. So there is this narrative out there that they're friends, he's interested, she's like, dude, we're just friends. Is she friend zoning Tom Cruise is now the question here. Uh, now, this article came in from... Uh, this was from El, Confid El Confidential, and uh, hold on, I'm going to get this in English. It just, it was earlier. There we go. English. Boom. Okay. I got the English translation. The unknown friendship between Shakira and Tom Cruise. Here it is, apparently broken down through sources to so this uh, Spanish website, that they've been friends for a while, guys. And uh, yeah, Tom only appears on her phone as Tom, because who else would it be? She's been one of the people, who's, uh, he has been... Um, uh, most aware of Shakira since relationship, Tom Cruise, uh, weekend was together in Formula One. We talked about this, but it's a relationship that goes a long way. Years ago, sources have affirmed uh, Cruise is uh, is a person devoted to his own. When the actor premiered the uh, second part of Top Gun, Maverick, uh, after a few months, he called Shakira on the phone to find out if he had uh, been able to go see her. If he had been able to, if she, I guess. It's hard. This translation is a little bad. If she had been able to see the movie, she was in low spirits to the separation and uh, from her fragile health of her father. But uh, Tom, you know, wanted to get her to go out and enjoy herself, I guess, and look at the movie. Kind of weird. You're date trying to date somebody like, hey, I know you're you're dealing with the loss of your father. I know you're down. Go see my movie. Go see my movie. Can you go see my movie? And let me know how it is. Well, apparently after the second call, she did go. Shakira was with her father and admitted that, no, she still had time, but that same afternoon she organized a visit to the movie theater to see the film. She later called Cruz, told him about her experience, and told him that her children had loved it. Several witnesses told us about it at the time, and the singer's own brother and the discreet Titonio, also right man, has told some friends from Barcelona with whom she is friendly. When did this friendship start? Well, they don't know how to, uh, the specific dates, but they assure us that the relationship has been fluid for years, and then in recent month, months has become closer due to her misadventures. Uh, children uh, of Ch of Shakira and Peak were were there uh, with her mother this weekend, and apparently he calls her. Tom calls the singer constantly to maintain a good friendship. Cruz said, "We always are aware. He's always aware of his friends. When he found out that Shakira was going through a personal moment, he showed our support and gave her advice to overcome uh, the incident. For relationship was uh, unknown to most to become clear this weekend, in which we've seen both of them chatting with great, obviously, chemistry." Both uh, Tom Cruise and Shakira have been great friends in the world of international stars, and the actor maintains a very good relationship with almost everyone he's known for his kindness, dedication, uh, and some of this, this is if you want to be in Tom Cruise's club of who he checks in on the most, allegedly Michael Caine, Steven Spielberg, Will Smith, David Beckham, Salma Hayek, and as we've seen now, Shakira. Now, we talked a little bit about this during the live. Kim made a good point there. Yeah, it's like who else would really relate to being Tom Cruise or Shakira? These are global superstars. So it doesn't surprise me that, yeah, he may reach out to someone else going through a huge public battle because they know they're not going to turn on each other. They're there to, like, keep private and have some fun. And, you know, they know what the pressure and the celebrity dumb is like. Shakira is massive globally. So, yeah, it doesn't surprise me. And clearly, it seems like he does have a, you know, eyes for her. Come on. Who wouldn't? I, I can't knock him for having a crush on Shakira. My goodness. Uh, yeah, it's just, it's, it's, uh, not surprising at all. So there you go. But apparently this was something that was going on for a while. They've had this friendship. They are now getting closer and now they're being seen out in public together. It'll be interesting to see if this grows into something else. Uh, you know, the Scientology part of it is this, is this a recruitment or is Tom doing less of that? We've talked about that previously. And in fact, I'll put it at the end of this video, watch our Scientology video with Aaron Smith Levin. We broke down the sort of struggles that Tom has to be facing with that. And again, I'm not trying to give you know him to ignore the religion. I have massive issues with his religion, of course. But how, yeah, how much does he actually know? He claims a lot, but I, I, a part of me is like, I don't think he's been as uh, vocal about it for reasons, clearly knowing it's not a good look. Uh yeah, it's it's kind of, Tom. My relationship with Tom Cruise now is complicated. I love him as a movie star. I really dislike him as a Scientologist, and I wish he would just out it. And uh, I think the redemption for Tom Cruise could be massive. 
But will Shakira be able to deal with that heat, deal with the Scientology? It seems like even Tom's been afraid to put himself out there as often. He wouldn't do the Oscar appearances. He doesn't want to get mocked or have his religion mocked. He just wants to go and make his movies. And I can respect that if his religion wasn't, you know, destroying lives. Sign religion, sorry, Scientology. Uh, so that's the big problem with Tom Cruise, but does Shakira look past it? Is she getting more of an insight? Is she considering Scientology? Oh my gosh, I want to hear all your theories. It's a very frustrating process with YouTube, but I want to hear your thoughts in the comments. Uh, let us know. Should Shakira run uh, Tom Cruise style away from Tom Cruise or should she uh, enjoy your time and see what happens here? Uh, let's see what happens. We'll keep you posted. Thank you guys so much for watching this story and more come in here on Popcorn Planet. There's a click on the left, the Tom Cruise story. I'll put it right there. If you have missed it, catch it now.